High school football season kicked off last night. It's the first time we've had high school football in 16 months. For the rest of our local teams, this season kicked off today. Last time I saw an Illinois high school football game, it was 2019 Murfreesboro playing for a state championship. Let's get you caught up. We'll start at Murfreesboro Red Devils hosting Heron in the first quarter. Heron at the Red Devil 40 Junior. Cameron Everett trying to convert on third and long. His pass is tipped into the hands of Justin Hunter. Brings that pick back 50 yards to the Tiger 10. It's seven nothing Murfreesboro after one. Second quarter, Murfreesboro getting the ball back after a fourth down stop. Calvin Clemens gets the handoff after the fake and just turns on the Jets. 52 yards to the house for the score. Red Devils would miss the extra point and go up 13-0 at the break. But this one would go down to the wire and Heron would rally back in the second half, beating out Murfreesboro 14-13. Let's head on over to Benton. Rivalry matchup. The Rangers hosting West Frankfurt. First play of the scrimmage. Keegan Glover to Aiden Newcomb. He's gone 69 yard touchdown. Keegan Glover is fired up. Rangers not done. Glover finds Reed Baumgart. A few nifty moves there, and he is off to the races. Steps out of bounds just before reaching the end zone, but Benton will still cash in on that. Glover. To Newcomb, hook him again, 13-0. Misses the extra point, but it does not matter. Glover will air it out again, and this time finding Wyatt McClintock. They'll add two, 21-0. Benton blanks West Frankfurt, 53-0. Next stop, Anna Jonesboro at Carterville. will start in the first quarter. Carterville hands off to Preston Summer. It's the four-yard run for a touchdown. Lions up 8-0. Carterville's Eli Downing. Quarterback keeps the run. 16 yards for the touchdown. It's 16-0, and Carterville just takes off from there. Preston Summer runs 42 yards. Another touchdown up by 29. It is the Lions' day today. Eli Downing passes to Bryce Anderson. 45 yards for another touchdown. Carterville mauls A.J. 43-0. Move on to Fairfield at Christopher Ziegler Royalton. Third quarter, Mules are up 23-6. Looking for more. Fairfield big up front, and they go with the run game. Blake Pruitt finds some room. First down, Bearcats sniff out the play. Brett Janello, well, he enters the game and makes an immediate impact. Interception in the end zone. What a huge play for the Mules. That's important. This time they're, uh, they're on the running game. Pruitt finds his way in for six more. It's 30 to six, fourth quarter. And hey, if it works, why don't we stick with it, Mules? We're winning the battle up front. Pruitt will tack on six more, and Fairfield will roll past Christopher Ziegler Royalton 39 6.